Hello there, boys and birds. My name is Adam Cleary, mere days away from a long-awaited haircut, and I am joined by long and hair in a sentence as well, Mr. Adam Nicholas, for a slice of your hashtag good after news. Coming at you so thick and fast today, your head will spin, because if you're wondering what's happening with that big WWE pay-per-view that's on the horizon, I'm going to tell you. He is going to tell you, but we've also got an update regarding... Sarah Logan's big exciting news, Adam Cleary, as well as another story regarding the US title, but we'll get to that in just a second because we're going to go back and talk to you. Sarah Rowe, we call her Sarah Logan these days. I guess she's Sarah Rowe because she is married to the man after all. She's pregnant. Hey, hey, what a hey. shock. I didn't see that one coming at all. Insert sarcasm here because, of course, we did. Uh, she announced yesterday she had a big update on her life in general, I guess people were asking, but yes, she has confirmed it on Instagram today. Sarah Rowe is pregnant, so I guess that means she'll be having a baby, Adam Cleary. That's, yeah, that tends to be what happens when you mm. get pregnant. Um, it does make you wonder if her release from the company is in any way tied to this, because you tend mm. to know you're pregnant a little bit before you tell other people you're pregnant. Not that I've ever been pregnant, of course, I've never done that myself, but I hear that's kind of how it works. <laughs> You've heard the rumours about this thing, but apparently it's true. I don't know, it's hard one to call, I guess, whether it was tied to that or maybe the result of mm. that, I guess. If you've got some spare time, maybe that's one thing you could do. Unless your name's Ronald Rousey and you are busy doing other things. But we digress. Yes, she said on Instagram, that is the big news. You can go and find out on her YouTube channel. She's got going with Eric Rowe at the minute. Is that his name? Well, it is now. Um, that's on there. <laughs> so there you go. A little bit of afternoon news for you. What else have we got for today, Mr. Clay? Oh, well, speaking of things that are quite surprising, WWE SummerSlam, which was definitely 100% going to go ahead. None of the ongoing global bastard, nothing was possibly could interfere in next month's big spectacular event. Well, um, it's not happening anymore. They haven't done an official statement yet, but according to reports on Pro Wrestling Insider, SummerSlam that was going to be held in a big arena full of big wrestlers with big stars having big matches in front of a big crowd is now big time not going to happen. It has been quietly being moved to the Performance Center along with Friday Night Smackdown and the proposed NXT TakeOver and Monday Night Raw. It's supposed to be a big four-day extravaganza for the company in which they were going to laugh in the face of global health concerns. But no, no, no. It seems that he who lasts laugh, lasts, laughs, 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 see who wears masks, Vince, veins, I don't know, something like that. Either way, it's not going ahead. It's still going to take place on its scheduled date of the 8th of the 23rd, although American calendars are quite weird to me. But, uh, yeah, no SummerSlam. No SummerSlam is what he was trying to get. Why would you ever go and watch the morning news when you can watch this? This is so much better. <laughs> we have got this down with tea, streamlined and mumbling madness from two lads. But, yes, that is... I mean, I don't think either of us are surprised about that, really, are the SummerSlam result. Um, Vince is defiant, but he's also not God, despite what he might tell you to the contrary. However... That might not have changed in the way they wanted to, but something that might be changed in the way we wanted to is the United States Championship, Adam Cleary, because Ooh. according to our friends who no longer, I would say, require a pinch of WrestleVotes anymore over at WrestleVotes, they have given us an update regarding that and said via Twitter today that there is the long-awaited debut of the new United States Championship title will take place tonight on Monday Night Raw. Source said the belt has a clean yet prestigious look. So get ready Ooh. for that one looking like something from Toys R Us, I guess, R.I.P. That's really nice. A clean mm. yet prestigious look is very much the opposite of my entire gimmick. So I'm very excited to see that. <laughs> um, I would try and like wrap this up with like, a, oh, have you seen kind of thing? But we all know that the only thing that was worth watching today was Peyton Royce's cameo video that she did for Adam Wilborn. Oh, so Go as I said that. on Twitter though, as I said on Twitter, whoever's going to be brave enough to get Billy Kay to do one saying that I do better quizzes, don't be shy now, it's only £83. But anyway, that is your hashtag good after news. I have been Adam Cleary, joined by Adam Nicholas. Where can they get you on Twitter? They can get me on Twitter at It's Adam Nicholas, but they can also do us a favour, I'm sure. Go on Twitter and wish Phil Chambers a happy birthday because it's his birthday today at Phil My Chambers for the, the man who is the glue of a lot of things you probably mm. don't know about. Adam Cleary, where can they find you on Twitter? Uh, it's at Adam Cleary, C-L-E-R-Y, but I would also encourage you to go wish Phil Chambers mm. a very happy birthday. The man lives on a boat. He needs all the joy he can get. But yes, thank you very much for watching. Let us know what you made of this all in the comments below. And of course, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. But until next time, this has been your hashtag. Good after news. And we will see you soon. <laughs> nope, still don't <laughs>